Okay, here's a good question. How does one keep from getting affected or even infected by other people's opinions? <laughs> Isn't that a classic, huh? Um, good question, huh? The thing is, nothing in the world has any power over you unless you give it power. And you're going to give it power if you're not coming from that place of integrity within you. Then it's very easy to give your power away, to be uncertain about yourself and be um, hurt by other people's opinions or swayed by other people's opinions. But if you are coming from that power place, then you're able to hear other people's opinions you're able to filter, if it's critical, or attacking, or judgmental, or anything, you're able to filter out the, the discordance, and get the gift out of it, yeah. For example, just lately, uh, where I'm living in Bali, I have the opportunity to get some land um, adjacent to where, where I'm actually, the land that I'm actually stewarding now for 20 years, another piece of land came up right next to it, yeah. So I asked, um, you know, if I could have, you know, first, first, first choice, if they could give me the chance to get it before anyone else. So they agreed, and um, I started to, um, you know, get the cash together for this land. And then someone um, in the area objected very strongly, very, very, very strongly, and personally attacked me with a long list of reasons why I shouldn't get the land. And they were all personal, deeply personal, critical, judgmental reasons, yeah. And um, so I, I listened and I just sifted the non-integrous, irrelevant um, nonsense from the essence of what, what was being communicated to me. And I just took it in and I just used it as motivation just to raise my game, to um, sharpen my awareness and, you know, just improve my, you know, my whole, my whole walk in life, just to really look at myself. But I'm still going ahead with my intention to get that land, you see. So as long as you're coming from a place of integrity within you, as long as you're every day sitting in the silence and the peace and the presence of your own spiritual nature, you can hear and receive the opinions of others without it affecting you in a negative way. And you can distill the gift in, in whatever someone else's opinions are. And there's nothing wrong in, in, in um, you know, listening or hearing other people's opinions, especially if, you know, they, they feel very strongly about something that you're, that you're doing or not doing, you see? But it's all about coming from that place of integrity within you. And then, to fortify, you can't, this thing about, you can't um, be affected or infected by the world, you can't be disempowered by the world, unless you allow it to happen, unless you do something or don't do something within yourself, that allows it to happen. And the main, once you, if you've got, if you're coming from that place of integrity within you, your main defense from all the negativity and toxicity in the world, or the energetic discordance in, in all of its manifestations, your main defense is to radiate compassion. It's as simple as that. And if you're coming from that place of, of integrity within you, which is a place of love, and, and deep, 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 deep inner peace, and you're using the attitude of compassion, you're radiating that out, and however you, you know, you instill that um, habit, uh, for instance, practicing the attitude of ho'oponopo'ono, and doing forgiveness prayers, whatever it is, practicing sun pop, um, these different strategies that we have in the training, the main th the fundamental thing is is that your attitude is one of compassion and if you're extending that compassion extending that forgiveness extending that mercy extending that love that charitable um, heart-centered 
goodwill out into the world, then nothing can actually infect you or affect you. But it's when we shut that down, especially if we're not coming from a place of integrity within ourselves, and we shut that down and we go into judgment and denial um, and all the variations in between, then that's when we get into trouble. You see? So thanks for the question. I hope that's made things clear.